Hi, welcome back to Libya's Daily Devotionals and today we're going to be talking about Faith and fear cannot flow out of our heart at the same time because fear blocks faith and vice versa. Remember the passage where Jesus walked upon the waters? When Peter saw Jesus, he said, Lord, if it is you, command me to come to you on the water. Matthew 14, is 28. Jesus immediately gave the order and Peter was able to walk upon the waters as well. The Bible says that soon a great storm suddenly appeared, and when he saw it, Peter became fearful. He began to sink, and Jesus had to extend his hand to save him. This passage demonstrates that when fear is allowed to enter the heart, it pushes out faith. The enemy will always try to break the rhythm of your communion with God in all areas. If doubt or fear finds a space in your heart, fear wills ever your faith and you will not see any miracles. But when the supernatural power of God intervenes, it tears them apart, restores order and faith in your life, giving you the victory. So today, Choose not to conform on your conform to your problems around you. Keep your sight firmly on the Lord and walk confidently above the storm. Walk by faith, not by sight. Many times we ignore small fears because we think they are minor and they will go away. For example, when we enter a dark room or hear noises or feel cold chills, we think that they are silly. And if we tell someone, they will laugh at us. Maybe the devil wants us to keep these things secret because he has a stronghold in the occult. However, we must be aware that when fear enters the heart, faith goes away. No matter what kind of fear you are feeling, fear is fear. And it is an evil spirit that paralyzes and does not let you act. Today, renounce, break that tie, and be free forever. Pray with me. Lord Jesus, in your name, I renounce any spirit of fear, doubt, and fear and phobia. I rebuke, bind, and cast out these evil spirits and declare that your power makes them flee. They have no place in my heart. Now my faith increases and the spirit of boldness and courage comes into my life. Thank you, Father because you make me free from the bondage of fear. In the name of Jesus, Amen. Thanks for watching and may God bless you all and stay safe.